I've said this before, that when you're down and when you're grumpy, decide in that moment to go forth in a joyful way. It is one of the great powers of spirituality when you realize you can control your day. In Psalms 126, verse 2, listen to this. It says, Then our mouth was filled with laughter, and our tongue with shouts of joy. Well, live the Bible. Go out and and decide you're going to do that even when you don't feel like it in the beginning. You're going to make one of the great discoveries of life that you feel like it pretty soon. You change your whole mind. You rein in the bad thoughts, and you begin to radiate something that attracts other people's laughter and smiles and and good wishes. The universe responds in kind to your cheerful, joyous, and happy attitude. Any mist of melancholy or cloud of gloom, it breaks, it disperses under the radiant light of God's joy. No darkness can remain in the presence of heartfelt laughter, love, and joy. As you let the light of your joy shine forth, you become a beacon of cheer for others. You uplift others, and others respond to your happy nature with words and deeds of friendship and of caring. Your happiness and laughter, they're seeds that you plant for an increase of goodwill. You nurture these seeds and you reap a harvest of gladness. Your relationships are enhanced. Your health improves. You'll be surprised at your energy And you'll find that you have all that you need to live the abundant life. You're cheerful and you are radiantly alive. You're happy and you are a radiating beacon of light, of love, of laughter to all that you meet.